So I was about to start recording, and this is what happens. Welcome back to Minecraft Slider. Oh, I'm getting pulled in. Then I, I took off this mod for Evilcraft, because it was limiting some stuff I could do with Evilcraft. And after the update, it's back in, and now I gotta take it back out again, because this is a pain. Hey, get away from me. Here we go. We're going for a trip. Can you fling me? Oh, whoa, oh, whoa. Oh, we are all up in this thing. And in the water. Oh, whoa, no, still in it. Still in it. I'm like stuck in here. Come here. Come on, sprint. Sprint. I am like completely stuck right here. Alright, welcome back guys, it's Slutter and we are back on Revenge of the Sea Team. And I know it's been a while, and I promise it, these breaks will not be like this uh, anymore. Um, after I got back from vacation and got a couple episodes put out, uh, something came up, and we ended up actually moving, and it just took me a while to get everything resituated and get all my computer and everything set back up, as well as all my audio stuff and, you know, everything else. So, yeah, uh, but we're back. We are back, and we are going to get back at it, and as you can still see, I am in my land witchery because that's what I want to do today. I love traveling to new dimensions, and so I figured in today's episode, we can travel to a new dimension. So that's what we're going to do. We are going to take the first like dimensional travel through witchery, which is to the spirit world. And to do that, we need a brew of sleeping. And we're going to just jump right into it, right? So we've got the brew of sleeping here, and I'm going to need a whiff of magic, which I think I already have some. Uh, it comes from the Rowan saplings. And then purified milk. I don't remember the recipe for purified milk. Uh, it's milk... Odor of purity in three empty jars. And odor of purity comes from the Hawthorne sapling. Cool. So we can do both of those pretty quickly. And get those started. Um, I should have a whiff of magic already. I do have a whiff of magic already. And um, let me just grab some of these. And do I have Hawthorne saplings? I have six Haw Hawthorne saplings. Okay, cool. Hopefully one of these will reap what I need. Okay, I didn't actually need those jars. Hey, I need you though. Get back here. All right. And there we go. We got our order of purity. I'm going to go ahead and take the rest of these out because uh, I only need one right now. And I don't want to use all my saplings up just in case something happens to my trees outside. Because as you can see, anything can happen in the very, very beginning. I literally just jumped back on the server. It's like, hey, welcome back to Minecraft. Here's a freaking uh, tornado. But I am going to be taking out the weather mod because personally, I'm not a fan of it. I don't see an addition to the game, like a beneficial addition to the game. So, you know, whatever. Um, cookies. So this is one thing I had started doing. Uh, as you see, I had some trees out here that weren't there last time. And it's because I knew I was going to be doing this episode. And I didn't want to have to take forever to wait for cocoa beans. So I started farming up some cocoa beans, which you can see. But I don't have any wheat. I don't think I'm carrying any wheat on me. I mean, it would be really weird if I was. Because I don't eat anything anymore. So, um, yeah. We're going to go ahead and head back. And this should take me back to my house. I think I've only got a couple of these set up now. Alright, we are back at the house. Cool. And I'm actually going to recharge real quick while we talk. Because I know I've been gone for a while. And um, I've been wanting to get back into it. But, you know what? This is going to be so much quicker if I just do this. Um, I totally forgot what I was about to say. Yeah, I've been gone for a while, but that's that's not going to be the case anymore. I am, I'm back at it, and I will continuously be back at it. But I will say that I have been reading your comments, and I have been trying to reply to them as soon as I see them. And I, one, okay, I've had a couple really good comments, but one really caught my eye that I really liked. And I haven't really tested the fact that uh, mobs, like, you know, when this thing takes stuff in and uh, produces energy or whatever... I haven't noticed that if mobs add energy to it or add matter to it, but someone had made a comment about putting cursed earth under the anomaly and letting those mobs get sucked in, and I thought that was an ingenious idea because, first of all, it's just funny having the mobs die like that, and second of all, it would help build my anomaly. Not that I, this thing is going to be, it's way more power than it ever has to be 
for the rest of the series. And I think I literally could power anybody who ever came on the server and uh, just do it through Tesseracts, and I think we'd be totally fine. But you know what? More is always more fun, I think. Uh, some things I like to do in abundance, and obviously power I've done in abundance, as well as some items that I get in there. So I think that would be a great, great lot of fun to try to do that. And just watching, you know, mobs get sucked up into it would be pretty entertaining too. But anyways, I need to grab some wheat. Uh, that's barley. Uh, there's my wheat over there. Okay. Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and get myself a little wheat. I don't need a lot. Just a little bit. Come on, get in there. There we go. So, man, nine's enough. And I'm going to go ahead and just throw these away. So I can make the cookies now. And I got to see if I have any um, little icy picky things. What are they called? Ice needles. I don't know if I have any ice needles. Uh, ice needles. No, I don't. All right, so I'm going to have to get those. Well, I have um, pickles. You're still here, pickles. Man, I forgot about you. It's been a while. It's been a couple weeks. I know it's been a long time, but we're going to get back at it. I promise um, it is going to be continuous. I don't want to give up on this. I've been working hard to try to get other people on because I really, really like this mod pack. I'm having a lot of fun with it. And I'm actually getting a lot of replies from uh, you guys uh, telling me how much like you know, you're know you enjoying it and stuff like that. And I don't want to quit it. But I'm telling you, it, it does sometimes get boring when you're by yourself. I, I'm not going to lie. It it really can get kind of, you know, boring and tedious. And I, I'm going to try, I'm trying to fix that. I'm trying to alleviate that problem. So, you know, we're working on it. We are working on it. Uh, do I have a table in here? Nope, my table's on the outside. Okay, cool. So we're going to make up some cookies. And odor purity. Oh, yeah, I was going to need that for the milk, right? Yes. Um, oh, I need a cocoa bean. So come here, please. Ooh, a threefer. All right. So we'll make up some cookies real quick. And I'm going to have to go back. Oh, no, because Mr. Pickles is going to give me um, uh, mushroom stew, isn't he? Yeah, where, where can I get some milk from? I wonder if I have any milk anywhere. Uh, maybe in my kitchen. My kitchen, I could possibly have some milk. I'm not sure. Huh, what is this? Enderdew? Okay. <laughs> Anyways. Um, so, oh, water artichoke. And then this brew of love. Okay, uh, red poppy, I'm sure I've got. Golden carrot, I can do easily. Lily pad, easy. Artichoke, and then another whiff of magic. Okay. <coughs> so we're going to need two of those. And then what was that milk recipe again? It was uh, odor of purity, which I have three jars and a milk. Okay. Three jars and milk. Okay. So I guess we're going back to the other house again. And, oh, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Something crazy going on. Um, do you have a hammer on me? I don't know what's causing that, but kind of crazy um i want to go charge the cell back up does it still oh tell me the power is not too low now oh man it got below what was freaking out causing that what was draining it Okay, so that's empty. Do I have a power cell on me? Please tell me I have a power cell on me or some. Those don't hold power. Tell me I've got a power cell on me somewhere. I don't. Son of a gun. This is going to be a long flight. Um, well, let me grab this poppy because I'm going to need you. And I think I got a golden egg. Yeah, I need some, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Because I'm going to have to go grab a carrot and I got that. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and pause here because you guys do not want to watch this flight because I don't know if I ever showed you how far I traveled, um, but I traveled a very long distance. And as you can see, it's going to take a while to get back. Yeah, a long while to get back, but I did finally find it. But So I'm going to go ahead and fly over there and we will be back. Okay, so I thought of something. I was getting ready to leave. And I was like, hey, remember... I just did that waystone at the end of last episode, right? 
And since that's not going to have power, I'm not going to be able to warp back to it anyways. So why not grab our waystone, which is... Oh, uh, wait, hold on. Wrong one. There we go. Our waystone here. And I'll grab some chalk and some golden chalk, because I think I'm going to need that. And I'm going to go ahead and pick up the... Uh, oh, what do you call it? shouldn't have that in my hand um the altar over here and maybe we can power one to send me back over here huh i think that sounds doable use a little bit of the witchery while we're at it right i just think it makes sense i got everything here candelabra the chalice all that my altar my heads i don't think any one necessarily adds more than the other but okay and I think, okay, yeah, this is going to be a really long flight. Um, maybe we'll talk while we fly. I don't know exactly how long it's going to take, but I know it's a long flight. Um, it's a really, really long ways away. But anyways, guys, um, yeah, well, you know what? We will talk about something real quick. Because the one thing I want to talk about is upcoming. We have been discussing, myself and a couple of the guys that we've been playing with, I've had a hard time keeping regulars, like, on the server, playing, uh, recording, putting up, you know, stuff or whatever. And, and you see, actually, some of the bigger name guys or whatever um, who are, you know, like uh, Chimneys, right? Chimneys videos have kind of completely died off when it comes to uh, Revenge of the Sea Team. And I know a lot of that probably has to do with the fact that, you know, Pungent wasn't very on very often. And Paul Sorge Jr., he was supposed to be doing it. Anyways, th their series kind of died off after about a month or two, right? And it's because these guys are busy and they're doing other things and possibly just a lack of interest, you know, whatever the case may be. And they've started a new series doing uh, Unturned, which, by the way, I say check it out because I freaking I'm loving Unturned. I'm loving the development of Unturned. I haven't done any videos on it, but I do actually play it quite a bit. And I really, really enjoy Unturned. Um, and I'm actually enjoying their new series that they started up. I like the whole PvP aspect and all of them supposed to be criminals or whatever. And it's a fun little, you know, role play that they've been doing. But back to you know our part or whatever is we wanted to do something fun so one thing i had discussed with a couple of the guys was whoa what is this building here how did i is this another witchery thing and i missed it as i went by i don't the walls there did i miss this when i flew by originally wow this one's pretty big actually huh we'll check that out anyways um we wanted to do something uh, with, you know, some of the guys, some of you guys who watch regularly, uh, comment regularly and stuff like that, possibly doing, um, like a little mini series or something like that. Like maybe a UH, UHC match, um, where we can kind of randomize teams and stuff like that and get everybody involved and just have some fun with it. And so, I mean, that, that option's there, but if this is something that interests you, I don't necessarily, I mean, put, you know, put stuff in the comments. If you've got ideas of something that would be fun to do in regards to like a, a team battle PVP kind of thing or whatever, I'll let my chunks load here, um, where you guys would like to get on with us and, uh, do that, go ahead and leave a comment or whatever, but message me, message me on Facebook or sorry, not Facebook, uh, YouTube, and let me know if that's something you'd be interested in doing. That way I can start reaching out and contacting people and uh, trying to get a group together. We're looking for anywhere from, you know, 12 to 15 people. Uh, so we make a couple, you know, teams of three or something like that. And maybe they'll do like a UHC or a build off or something fun where we can do a competition. And for those of you guys who have small channels like myself who want to, you know, uh, you know, put more material, more material or more content on your channel, I think this would be a great opportunity to do so. So um, with that being said, Go ahead, message me, um, throw something in the comments, let me know something that sounds interesting to you that would be fun, and I will definitely get back to you guys, because uh, we're really serious about this. I'm looking for more fun stuff to do. I, I love playing Minecraft. Obviously, I, I, I do it a lot. But it can get a little bit tedious at times when it's just you by yourself, and it's fun to interact with other people. Anyways, that's kind of my uh, my message for the day or whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and continue flying, and I'm gonna go ahead and break uh, the recording right here, and we'll pick back up when I get back to the house because, like I said, it is a long flight away. So we'll be back. Just wanted to show you this as I'm still flying because it takes a really long time. But welcome back, Slider. Your first night. Here's a blood moon with mobs everywhere. Yeah, they really can't affect me, but still, it's kind of annoying. Like, welcome back. We're going to give you every bad thing we can think of to remind you why Minecraft can be such a pain in the butt. All right. We'll be back. 
Look how many freaking mobs on one little island. That is nuts. Absolutely nuts. Man, imagine if you were on that island that Blood Moon started. All right, I know I'm getting close to my house. I know the numbers. I think it's somewhere over this way. I think I might have got a little bit north of it. But uh, anyways, we're almost there. That takes a really long time. And come here somewhere around here, right? Okay, that's a yeah, that's got to be it. Yeah, that's my lit up area, right? Yeah, because I put it all around the trees. Okay, cool. So we're in the right spot. We are in the right spot. I mean, who else would light up around a patch of trees, right? There's my house. Wow, that took a really, really long time. All of that just so I can come get some milk, basically. But I'm thinking since I'm here, what I might actually do is might build a couple tesseracts real quick. So I'm going to go ahead and pause real quick. Um, I was just going to get right back into it, but I think building a couple test racks will be really useful. Um, that way I can transpose power wherever I want, and I think that would be a good idea. So I'm going to go ahead and pause right here, build up a couple test racks real quick, and then we'll get back to uh, what we were going to do. So be right back. All right, guys, so we are back, and um, I, I, as you can see, I've got three test racks here and uh, whew, they take a while okay not really really long but to make a tesseract you basically got to have one of these fill tesseracts with some bronze and some silver right not a big deal to get the fill uh full tesseract frame you basically just make a tesseract frame fill it with resident ender and the tesseract frame is just hardened glass some enderium ingots which um well it takes a minute to make enderium you have to make this pyrethium dust and some enderium blend enderium blend is pulverized uh tin shiny metal and silver with a resident ender bucket so it takes a minute right but we've got them all made now and uh yeah that, oh God, that took a while as you see it's no longer blood moon because it's been a couple days since i did that but i was uh, about to put my first test rack frame down and then i thought hey maybe we should actually take a look at this and so um what we're basically doing is plopping this bad boy down right here connects in like that i'm just going to right click on it and i'm going to do house there we go and then this one is going to be doing um, send sending energy that's all it's going to be doing just sending energy right and that's going to be my house one right there and then the next one i'm going to do is witchery and that'll just be in receive mode and yeah that's basically that so now we'll have power there right so whoo, let me make the matching one here i think it's the smooth one right here wait which one do i have here Go away. Come here. Um, this is number five. Okay. Had to make a matching, of course. Um, I need number five. This one right here. Okay. Plug that hole. Okay, so now the power will always be going through the Tesseract, and I'll have unlimited power over at uh, the Witch Hut, too. So that's cool. And, yeah. This guy right here serves no purpose anymore. It was good while it lasted, but I think that guy kind of outpowers it just a little bit. So, yeah, whatever. Anyways, uh, we need to do a little circle magic over here because we want our waypoint to get us back. But before that, I gotta remember, the whole reason for coming over here in the first place was to get a bucket and get some milk. And poor Mr. Pickles over here. I don't think he's gonna yield any milk. I believe he's gonna yield me some uh, mushroom stew and I don't need that, so. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab both of these. And grab you guys, there we go. Excuse me, sir. You're like in the way. Thank you. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Okay, there we go. I'm gonna dump off some water here. Like so. And now I've got my milk buckets. And there we go. We're getting closer. Now I'm gonna go find a cow. Um, I don't have my animals back here anymore. Um, I killed him by accident. I think I think I recorded that. It was a sad day, but I think there's a cow down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There was like I think there's a cow down here. So let's go ahead and steal some milk. Thank you. And now we've got that. Alright, cool. Next, next, next. Circle magic. Where shall I put I have empty floors in this house. Maybe I will actually do the circle magic inside. I mean heck the tree is, you know, circular in nature. I didn't want to fly. No. 
I never did start clearing out the next level. So we'll just uh that works. Um Yeah, sure. I don't know how big I need to do this. Uh, I'm already full up, okay. Didn't mean to do that. Need to break out this one here. There we go. All right. Um, we should be a pretty close to being able to do a circle around here. Hey, what just happened? Did my axe just break? Oh, it's broken. Wow. I didn't hear a break sound or anything. All right. Um, throw you away. I don't need the torch right now. There we go collect all you up and throw you away. Too much wood. There we go. I like that you can do that. You just flush it out with another item. It doesn't always take the item. It just kind of it's an extra inventory spot. I think that's cool. It's a little extra inventory spot. Just boop and take that back. Throw you in there. There we go. All right, cool. So I think we can do some circle magic up here. Um, yeah, that's not going to break like that. All right. Uh, oh, the book. Yay, I need the circle magic book. I don't actually remember what I need for this right. Um, that's okay. We will we will figure it out. I don't need the ladder. Okay. Um... Book, uh, circle magic. There you go. Recipe for that bad boy. Uh, belladonna, ink sack, uh, feather, a book, and whiff of magic. Oh, I just so happen to have a whiff of magic on me. Okay. I need a book. I've got that. I need an ink sack. I've got that. I need a feather. I have that. But I don't think I... Yeah, I don't have any Belladonna here. I gotta go break some grass. Mm. Hopefully I'll get a Belladonna um, thing real quick. Make the book and then see what the recipe is. Because I... You know, it's... There's some things I memorize and some things I don't. And is that a Belladonna one right off the bat? Cool. Let's go plant that and bone meal that bad boy back uh, bat up. Um, let's see. Come here. Um, bone meal. Bone, bone, bone. I've got bones. One, two, three. Oh, yeah, I should probably collect this stuff. Um, oh, already full up. Inventory fills so fast. Uh, seaweed. Yeah, that was one of those. Cobblestone I don't need. Uh, wheat I don't need right now. Belladonna I do. There we go. All right, cool. Do, 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 do. And thank you for that. I can put my chisel away. Thank you. And there we go. Okay, cool. We're going to go plant this bad boy, get ourselves some belladonna, make ourselves a circle magic book, and remember how to transport ourselves back using the waystones. So, I know I've got empty plots up here somewhere. Ah, right here. That'll work. Belladonna seed. Go. Bone meal. Bone meal. Yay. Gotcha. All right, cool. And I'm going to go ahead and plant these two just for fun. No real need, but what is in this chest? Oh, yeah. No. This stuff. Oh, look at you. All this honeycomb and stuff. Ooh, a bee grab. Cool. Um, that is the uh, apiary from Pam's Harvest Craft. Oh, you know what? I might. I took all the time to do that up there. I can do the circle magic right here. That'll work. Yeah, we can do that. And craft this up real quick. So it was a belladonna, a book, an ink sack, a feather... I'm forgetting something. I'm forgetting something. What am I forgetting? What am I forgetting? Oh, yeah, the Whiff of Magic. There we go. And now that we got that. Okay, so now we want transportation location stuff. Um, binding. Transposition. Here we go. Teleport to the Bound Waystone's location. Bound Waystone. Um, is this that purple chalk in a 7x7? Do I have to make the purple chalk? Tell me I don't got to fly all the way back. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Um, 
That looks like the purple chalk, right? Yeah, yeah, because yeah, the, the numbers are colored for that purpose, right? Yeah, that's white, and then they do red and stuff. Okay, hold on. Is all the transportation with the purple chalk? Tell me that's not the case. I'll be very upset. Bound waystone, a blood, blooded waystone. Um, tag lock kick, ender do. Uh, transport iron from blood now. Oh my goodness, I think I gotta make the purple chalk. Which will be very upsetting. Okay, how do I make the purple chalk? Because I have some on me, so. Um, how do I make the purple chalk? Do I have to make it in that kettle? I think I have to make it in that kettle. Yes, with white, uh, pearl, tear the goddess, and nether wart. Oh, goodness gracious. I have to fly all the way back home. Hold on. I'm going to think about this. Is there a way to teleport myself all the way back there? Um, I haven't slept there, so death ain't going to help me. Um, oh. Huh. Oh, I don't want to have to fly all the way back right now. That would just make for a really bad day. It's probably something I should have looked up before we left, and I could have made that purple chalk. Um, because I'd have to remake everything here. I'd have to remake the kettle, and I'd have to... Well, I could give it power. Because I have all the stuff here to make power. But I don't know how much power I need. Oh, goodness. I wish it told you how much power you needed for these things. That would be so much better. I mean, you know what? I think it'd actually take less time to actually build all this stuff than actually fly back. So let's try. Um, iron. Iron, iron, iron. Oh, no. Iron's all out there. Uh, that paste, though. That paste. How much is that paste? Or what's the recipe for that? Anointing paste. Uh, Mandrix, oh, it's all the seeds. Do I have any of the other seeds? I have Belladonna now. Um, regular seed, under lily seed, barley seed, cotton seed, fossilized, yellow, yellow. Uh, what are the odds of me going to break the gr uh, grass right now and getting all four seeds? What are the odds? I don't know. You guys tell me. I would love to know the odds of getting all that stuff really quickly. I don't think they'd be very good. I, that's just me, but whatever. Um, I need iron. That's aluminum. That's iron. There we go. And we are going to make this guy right here. Do, 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 do. Cauldron. And now I gotta go break some glass. Glass? I mean, grass. And hope for, okay, I see, oh, oh, I got a couple. I hear a creepy crawly. Where's a creepy crawly? I hear you. Where are you at? Where did I get? I got Mandrake. I got Belladonna. I have so much junk in my inventory right now, I can't even freaking see what I have. So I'm going to go ahead. I don't need the glowstone right now. Um, I'm going to need those carrots eventually. I don't need this. Uh, apparently, I'm not going to need the yellow chalk. But I will need the white. Um, don't need the bone meal. Don't need the extra iron ingots. Okay, cool. So let's go collect more seeds. Come on. I can get them quickly. I can get them quickly. I know I can. Uh, this is probably the point where I should probably pause, but you know we're just gonna play through. We are gonna play through. We are we're rocking it right now. Um, give me my sword. I don't need regular seeds. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, there's another one. I have to think that was a mandrake one again. No, that was a barley seed. Cotton seed. I don't need. Don't need clovers. I don't need regular seeds. Don't need barley seeds. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I saw another one. What was that one? Water artichoke seed. Okay, cool. What's the last one I need? Like, snowbell seed? I think that's it. I think they're like blue in color. Ah ha ha! There you are. Okay, cool. Snowbell seed, right? That was it? Okay, cool. Now. 
Hopefully it's these four is what I need. Sweet. Okay, cool. So we've got that. And let's go make this bad boy. I'm going to put him down here. Okay, the fire's going to go there. Wait, was that up? Oh, it's one of my uh, little blood lamp things. Um, without my particles on it, I never see where the blood lamps are at. So, uh, let's see. I'm going to need some nether rack. All right, I need one of you and a flint and steel. Um, I've got the iron. Iron, where did I put you? Did I reorganize you? There you are. Oh, there you are. Iron there. Um, no, I just wanted one. There we go. And make the flint and steel. Uh, of course, I have to actually make it, not just act like it. There we go. Got you, got you. What are you doing out here, dude? Shut up. I want to hear from you. And another rat goes there. Fire goes there. Uh, where's the dirt block? Yeah, so I can place you next to it. There we go. And leave me alone. You guys are annoying. You don't do any damage. You just annoy me. So leave me alone. Anointing phase. Blingo, blingo. And. I have a feeling I'm gonna need some more trees and stuff over here. We will see. So let me grab these guys real quick. Bloop, 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 bloop. Bloop, bloop. Come on. There we go. And chalice and candelabra. Chalice. Chalice goes there. Candelabra goes there. I don't know if one or more heads makes a difference. I don't remember. But that's like 2,000. like 3,000 so one of them did something um, I think it's quite a bit of power is what you need though and I don't know if I have enough um, what was the recipe for that one? Oh, um, was a nether wart um, oh no I don't have the do oh man see I was trying to be all you know about it right and I could do this I can do this no I can't because I don't have Son of a gun. I don't have the uh, the witch's oven and stuff like that to get the, the dew that I needed. Um, what was it called? Um, this one. I don't have the tear of the goddess. I need the distillery. And the breath of the goddess of lapis. Oh. I have to fly back. I have to fly all the way back. Well... I'm not going to waste any of this stuff. I'm going to go ahead and collect it all. And I'm going to fly. And yeah. Oh, did I? I didn't think it would do that. Um, I don't need that. Oh, I got the iron ore. Mm -hmm. um, I don't need the cobble. I didn't think about how deep that would go either. I don't need the copper. I don't need the glowstone nook. But I got my candelabra. I got the skulls. Cool. So I'm going to go ahead and fly back. And then we are going to go to the spirit world. We we now have what we need. We've got the buckets of milk and stuff. And I'm kind of upset right now. Kind of very upset. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I've got that here now just in case I ever need it. And we can always do an altar here too. But... I'm going to fly back and we will be back as soon as I get there. All right. Okay. The one nice thing about flying around the map like this is I find random stuff. And this looks like it's an under, it's an underwater structure. I don't know what this is. I just saw this as I was flying by and I figured, Hey, let's check it out. Um, but I don't know what this is. 
I don't think. Is it just some random? Oh, oh, what is this? There's freaking what the heck is this? What in the world is this? Um. Well, let me get these guys all killed real quick. What is this? There's like colored wool and there's colored glass. Or... What is this nonsense? Let's see. What, what is this? Like wood in here? Um, who's shooting arrows at me? I don't even see anybody. There's a cross. Like an underwater church? How are you alive? I can't even see anything like... Oh, there we go. There's a little path right there. Okay. What is this? It's like a crypt. Hold on. I got my blood lamp on me, don't I? Yeah. Let's, let's light this place up real quick. Since these guys really don't do any damage to me anyways. Except you guys are really annoying, though. It's a freaking crypt. It's an underwater crypt. What in the world? Why is there a crypt underwater? And what purpose does this serve? And how are you guys still spawning? Oh, maybe because I didn't light up this side? What in the world? I mean... I love finding random stuff, but what in the world would be the purpose of this thing? Um, I'm getting a little laggy. We'll take a quick break up right Well, that was interesting. Some random underwater crypt. Cool. Whatever. Um, we're slowly getting closer. As you can see, I'm only about 2,300 meters out. So we'll be there shortly, and then we will get to that spirit world today. Oh, this is going to take a lot longer than I had originally assumed. I really do. I, I say it all the time. I plan these out. And then just randomness. I end up going one place and getting stuck and trying to figure a way out. And then that doesn't work. And we'll be there shortly. Alrighty. So we have made it back home. My goodness. And I was thinking about it as I was trying to, All that, literally, all of that was for a bucket of milk. That's what all that was for. I probably could have just done it with the iron hat on me and found a cow in the area and yeah that was basically all for a bucket of milk oh goodness but then I realized I had to get this all set up so I guess in the long run it was you know the whole trip was worth it uh, test rack oh no I want you there okay there we go and you're gonna be receiving energy from house and that should be charging you. Yep. Okay, so we're good to go there. And let me just grab a random piece of dirt over here to fill the hole. Because stuff's got to be pretty, right? And there we go. Now, no more issues with uh, traveling back and forth to the house. Ah, <sighs> problem solved. Okay. Now, back to the purpose at hand, which was making our sleeping potion, or brew sleeping. So... All right, a little glitch there, no big deal. Uh, brew of sleeping. Oh wait, I need here. Cause I need to make some of this purified milk. So brew of sleeping, here we go. All right, Can, got the cookies, um, icy needle. I need to go try to get one. out here. There's a couple of you, still nothing. Oh, was that an icy needle? Was that an icy needle? Please tell me that's not an icy needle. I don't need the seeds. I don't need the snowball, but I did get an icy needle. Cool. And I'm actually going to need two of those. Um, so I'm going to need one to wake me up when I get to the other side. So I'm going to plant a couple more of these. Uh, do I have bone meal on me? I think I had a whole bunch of bone meal. Bone meal. Bone meal. Bone meal. Bone meal. So much stuff. There's my bone meal. Okay. Let's go ahead and bone meal these bad boys up real quick. All right, I guess that's all I get. All right.
right and we will plant more of these seeds here and did I get another I did not get another icy needle <sighs> do I have any bones 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 after all those skeletons I killed I would think I have some bones but I don't seem to be seeing any oh good grief I don't see any Let's see if I have any more in here, because I'm going to at least want one more icy needle so I can wake myself up on the other side. Oops. Not bone needles, icy needles. I need icy needles. I got three more bone meal. Come on, good luck. Come on, good luck. Keeps giving me. Still okay. No. All right. Well, we're gonna get this uh, brew of sleeping put together, and then uh, we'll try to get another ice needle before we leave. I mean, it doesn't really. You don't need it because if you die over there, you, it just sends you back anyways. So, not a major concern. Um, a, a water artichoke. Oh, and then the brew of love I gotta make too, which is my. Oh yeah, I need to grab another whip of magic because I used that one. Okay. So I've got that, got that, got that. I'm about to make that water arch. Okay, so I need to make the the purified milk, and I need. I hate those stupid poisonous things, but they don't bother me anymore, so it's okay. Um, water arch. That's what I need. Did I? Okay, I was like, I didn't disturb the grass, did I? Got the water artichoke. You know what? I don't need this ore right now. I don't need this cobblestone right now. I don't need this mossy stone. It's just all garbage in my inventory right now. Don't need the belladonna seeds. I don't care about these coins anymore. I've got way too many. All right. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Need it. Okay. Odor of purity with milk and three clay jars, which I have right there. Oh, I need some empty clay jars. And then we'll make this brew of love and we will knock ourselves out and yes we will we will get this done okay so milk odor purity three clay jars oh i had three clay jars okay cool all right put those other ones back i don't need snowballs right now um i don't need my ritual chalk just trying to get stuff sorted out like it's, it's crazy how fast all this stuff fills up. Um, oh, yes. Brew of love. That's what we need. Brew of love. Golden carrot. Oh, that's what I forgot. Carrot, lily pad. I've got cocoa beans. I've got the whiff of magic. i got a water dry, and I can... A poppy. Okay. Fortunately, I don't have to worry about it now. Now I can just whip back to the house. <sighs> now that this is working. Oh, my goodness. At least I don't ever have to do that flight again. This Tesseract has solved the flight problems permanently, which is nice. I just run back and forth. But I do need to get a carrot. And what else did I need over here? Uh, a carrot and a lily pad. I want a poppy while I'm here too, I guess. Carrot, lily pad, and poppy. Pickles, you stay there. Carrot. Lily pad. And a poppy. I have no poppies. I have no, no poppies really. That's what it is. It's not a rose, right? It's a poppy. Yeah, I don't have any poppy. Wow. All right. Well, let me make this golden carrot real quick. And excuse me, sir. I need to go find a red flower. Ha ha ha! Right there. All right. Um, you, you, cocoa bean, water artichoke, cocoa bean. Do I, have any, I don't have any cocoa beans on me, do I? All right. Well, now I have everything. Hopefully, hopefully, I think I saw everything that I needed. I'm gonna need one more water artichoke for the other rest part of the recipe. But yeah, I think we've got everything we need. All right, let's go. Back to a tree. I love the little purple particle effects. 
least I know I'm going the right place. There we go. Let me get another water artichoke over here. And, oh, I cut a couple more seeds. All right. I don't know if I'll ever need this many water artichokes. I don't remember needing that many. All right. Um, you right there. Brew of love. Uh, oh, in the kettle. In the kettle. No. Now I gotta make a kettle? I gotta make a kettle? Let's look at the recipe for a kettle. Didn't even notice that. I just thought it was a crafting recipe. Kettle. Kettles with a stick and a detune stone. Okay, we can do that. Lava bucket, diamond, whiff of magic. We got this. Lava bucket, whiff of diamond, magic. Um, whiff of magic. Um, oh, well, I can do lava with this. No diamonds here? I thought I had diamonds. Are they in here? I gotta get more diamonds. Oh my goodness! Oh, 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 too many trips back and forth, I swear. Too many trips back and forth. I should put this plate inside the house um, with another Tesseract. Oh, you know what? I have a Tesseract on me. And I have a plate on me. I could do that. I could, could, could do that. But, you know, it, it's not that far away. It's okay. Uh, a diamond. A diamond. A diamond. I have so many diamonds. I think this is 500 or how many is that? All? 314. Regardless, that's a lot. Um, lava? Lava. All right. This is a quick recipe. I can do that one really, really quick. Make my tombstone. Um, what else am I looking for? Whiff of magic. Okay, got the attune stone. Cool. Now, a kettle. Three string, a cauldron, and two sticks. I should have string on me. I would think. I would think. Yeah, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plenty. Okay, cool. Sticks. Yeah, we know we can get those pretty easily. What are you doing anyways? You're fully charged. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're doing just fine. Doing just fine. All right. Do I have any wood to make sticks with? Ha, ha, ha. Okay. Okay. Oh, gotta grab the string. One, two, three. And I need iron. Um, where's my iron at? No, I just had a whole bunch. Oh my goodness, I had diamonds right there. Arr! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Cauldron went there. Toonstone went there. Sticks went there. And string goes there. All right, cool. We got the kettle. Now I need to, I, I don't want to just like throw it up against the wall, but I think I might just do that for right now just to get this done because, oh my goodness, this is taking way longer than I had ever thought. Um, oh, and I need to set my, oh, that was kind of cool, the spot I chose. I literally just picked that spot at random. Um, uh, I did it from the other house so I'd be able to not pay too close attention as I was flying. Yes, okay, candelabra right there. Um, chalice right there. Creeper head. Put, eh, put you right there. The zombie head. We'll put you right there. It's like creepy that these guys are just staring at you while you're doing this stuff. There we go. All right. That looks like plenty of power for right now. For right now, yeah. And then the kettle is going to need a fire source as well. So. What I might do, oh, and I'm going to need glass jars, aren't I? 
I'm gonna need glass jars. Um, do I have any nether rack on me randomly? Any nether rack by any chance? Nope. This is this is just getting tedious now. This is getting so tedious. Ah, uh, it's one thing after another. Um, I well I brought nether rack for that one. Tell me I have some more nether rack. That would be awesome. Oh wait 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 wait. I think I think I think I think. I think I put one of these in the nether. Um, I did, nether fortress. Um, why? Okay, there we go. Please, 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 please. Please, 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 please. Please. You can do it. Okay, there it is. All right, cool. Let me see where I'm at. All right, cool. Stop lagging on me. Okay. Um, you. You're going to be receive only also. All right. Cool. You receive full power. Cool. All right. And we will put this back right there. And now I just need to go get a piece of another rack. Oh, I'm only just grabbing one real quick. Whoa, whoa. That pick is faster than I think it is sometimes. And uh, this one is actually not going to take me home. I want to take me back to Witchery. So I'm going to go ahead and stop you. Witchery plus. And this should take me back to Witchery, right? Hopefully. Oh, that's a good sound. Yes, okay. Okay. Now we're cooking with fire. Alrighty. So I have the nether rack, so I can get that kettle going. I have unlimited water with my uh, sigil. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and put you down. No. A little deeper there. There we go. And we'll light a little fire there. There we go. And we'll put the kettle right there, okay. And let's go ahead and just, for right now, just like that, should be cool. That's like kinda cool, I mean, we put the attune stone, so it's got the little stone looking thing there. That's actually kinda, I, I like that. That's some good attention to detail right there, if you ask me. I like that. Um, let me get my sigil. Water. Um, get out of here. Hey! Hey, hey, hey. Get that poison sack out of there. Um, shoot, now I gotta extinguish this fire. Oh, you got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. Okay. Um, why is there edge stone? Oh my goodness. My bound pickaxe got me again. Oh my goodness. All right. Um. Oh, good grief. Okay. Okay. So the fire's got to be right here. So you're going to be right there. Hey, that's not the one I want to put there. Oh, so frustrated right now. So, so frustrated. In between this episode and next, I'll definitely be doing some redecorating. Oh, that's just so frustrating right there. So frustrating. Okay, so the fire's gonna be, yeah, so we'll put you there. I'm gonna put a little space in between these two here. Like this. We'll dig out this guy real quick. And we'll dig out right here. And we'll put another rack there. There we go. 
At least I can get in between. All right, so that'll be lit. That'll be lit. And hey, hey, hey! All right, and where's the kettle at? The kettle's right there. All right. Now water. Oh, it's filled. It's just not visually showing it. Okay. Oh. Okay, so that's not good right there. Um, I'm going to put some dirt up here. <coughs> so I don't kill myself with fire. But it says it says it has water in it. Okay, cool. Wow, after all of that. Um, it was the carrot, the lily pad, the poppy, a whiff of magic, a water artichoke, and... Man, I gotta go back and look. Uh, potion of love. Oh, cocoa beans. Cocoa beans, okay. My puppy's getting sassy. She's getting sassy over there. Hey, Summer. Nope. Alright. Throw the cocoa beans in. Oh, I gotta still make my glass jars. Well, we're started. We are started, so... There we go. Now, um, I gotta go find some sand and cook up some sand. I only need three, so. I don't think I'm carrying any glass on me. I'd be kind of not surprised because I have so much junk in here. I did have sand, but I don't see any. So we're gonna do, oh, I already have cobble on me. Put a regular furnace inside here. Just because why not, right? Oh, how long this episode has become. So much longer than originally planned. Is that sand? Yeah, that's sand right there. You and you. There we go. Three things of glass, please. So I can make some glass jars. I can make the potion of love. And then I've got the purified milk. I've got the artichoke. I've got the ice and We will get there. We will get there. And I think what we'll do is actually get there. And then maybe the next episode should probably start there. Because, wow, this has taken a lot longer than I had anticipated. Um, this was not the intent by any means. But, you know, stuff happens. So, wow, the entire wall just gone. First it got wrecked by a creeper. Then I wreck it completely. Oh, good grief. With my uh, blood magic pickaxe. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Well, at least I've got this. At least some of this has been successful. So that's good, right? All right. And I got three of them. Cool. All right. Hey. Hey. Yo. I mean, just because there's a hole in the wall doesn't mean you're allowed to come in, okay? Back off. All right. Oh, there's a creeper out there. You stay out there. I probably should probably put a barrier up so they can't come through, huh? Um, there you go. Okay, good enough. Stay out. I don't want any creepers sliding in here. Oh, look at all those little poison guys out there. Man, they're annoying. Um, okay, so. Brew of sleeping. I think I've got everything now. Purified melt. Icy. Alright, we've got it all. We've got it all. Artichoke, brew, icy, cookie, whiff, milk. That, 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 and that. Uh, 
Um, tell me this doesn't have to be done on a regular table. <sighs> Let's go outside of the regular table. Sword out, because I saw a creeper. I saw a creeper. You get away. You're just annoying. I saw a creeper. I don't know where he went, but I saw him. I don't want him blowing up anymore in my house. There he is. Yeah, you... Whoa, there's more of you guys? Wow. It's all up in this area. Okay. Let's start standing away from stuff. Like, do it from a distance. <coughs> okay. Milk, whiff, cookie, icy. Okay. Milk, whiff, cookie... Icy, artichoke, love. Wait, is this in the kettle too? Of course it is. Because I'm really, really just not paying attention. You figured I would have looked at that, right? After the first crafting recipe didn't work, which means I need three more glass. Um, you, you figure I would have looked at that. That would that would have been a logical thing to do. No, no. I didn't think that would be an issue. That would be complete nonsense. Why would one be in the kettle and the other wouldn't? I would just be crazy. Um, so more glass. Glass. There it is. All right. More glass bottles. More water. All right. We got this. We're going to make our brew sleeping. We're going to go late. Really? <coughs> really, really, really. Okay. All right. Kettle. Water. Good. Okay. Artichoke. Cookie. Whiff, milk, love, icy. With everything, right? Milk, whiff, love, cookie, icy, artichoke. Yeah, that was everything. Brew of sleeping! Alright, we have three of them. I can't run back in here anymore. Um. Let's try to go to the safe confounds of the house. And let's go hit up a new dimension. Um, I almost want to do it on the roof. I just, I feel like the roof's a little bit safer because it's so well lit. And, oh my goodness. It's just been such a hassle. Come on, go, bro. Alright, brew sleeping. I think I'm safe. I kind of want to put up a barrier. I'm putting up a barrier just to be safe you can never be too safe when it comes to creepers and stupid stuff in this game all right here we go we're sleeping um i'm laying half dead in the rocks i was like is it glitching what's going on all right i wonder if i can get lucky and get like the happy spot first because i know there's ways to increase the chance of getting the happy spot and not getting the nightmare um but odds are I'm getting a nightmare right off the bat, which is okay. Cause I just want to run around and get some of that disturbed cotton, um, and then head back. And I don't know, I don't know if I will take the disturbed cotton back with me if I die. I don't know that. I know that I can take it back if I use the icy needle. So this will be interesting. This will be interesting. I'm not going to get too far away from where we're at right now. And I, the one thing I love about doing this one is because it's an identical map uh, to the one we were on. Whoa. So you can see how much work I did. <laughs> this is all the stuff that I cleared out to build that house. And then, uh, like, right over here, I believe, is the... Uh, is it? Come on. I can't morph? I can't morph. Um, over here is the... Yeah, there's the village right there. But, yeah, you can see I... I cleared out a lot of land over here to uh, make this little house and the farm. And so it's, a, it's an identical map. It's just a nightmare. Ooh, what is that? It's a zombie. Oh, I don't have my sword on me. Whoa. Um, let's let's head over to that village. I, I feel that's going to be a little bit safer. Especially if one of those nightmares shows up and starts beating up on me. Um, because I don't have any of my trusty stuff. Um, oh, is this it? Wispy cotton. Wait, hold on. I thought. Wait, why didn't I? Okay, there we goes. Okay, um, I'm getting some major lag here. I did finally morph. 
Um, I thought this was supposed to be disturbed cotton in the dark place. And I was pretty sure you should break it. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, so it is wispy cotton, but when you pick it up, hey, hey, hey. But when you pick it up, it becomes disturbed cotton. Okay, interesting. Um, hold on one sec. Okay, sorry about that. The puppy was getting a little unruly and I had to put a kibosh on that. Wasn't having it. Oh, you can still hear her. Okay, so there's a really weird lag going on in this place. Haha, <laughs> I can fly and you can't, so I can beat you up. Oh, that would take a really long time, so we're not going to bother with that. Um, I'm just going to get some more of this disturbed cotton real quick. Running circles around this uh, nightmare guy. But, I mean, that's really cool. I've had times where it took me, like, an hour to find some of this stuff. So having it, like, right here is really nice. Um, now, if the server could catch up with my gameplay, that would be even better. Hey! I'm already getting messed with this freaking nightmare. Do you really need to mess with me, do you? Man, you're annoying. Okay, I got ten disturbed cotton. Wow, there's just mobs everywhere. Oh, wow, look at There's no wall here. It's just the village. That's kind of crazy. That nightmare is chasing me down. The mushroom. Get him. Come on, villagers. Come on, guards. Get him. Oh, he's like killing them. Oh, hold on. Let me get him out of there. I don't want to kill all the guards. That would just not be nice. Uh, let's see if I can get some more of this disturbed cotton. And... I don't know if I can take it back with me now. So that'll... Okay, so I died. Okay. Which was kind of not quite the time I was ready to do it. But, let's see if I took the disturbed cotton. Method. I think I did. Oh, I did. Okay, cool, cool. So we got it. All right, so we are in a good spot. So, yes. After all that, we have our disturbed cotton. So we can start making a couple dream catchers. And uh, we'll also make ourselves a couple of things to try to get to the happy land. And start building over there. But, you guys, I know this is a really long episode. Let me know if it's too long. Um, let me know if you want me to cut it back down. I know a lot of you guys said you like longer episodes because it's just more to watch. And in this episode, really wasn't getting much done because it was the, the length was more because I kept missing stuff and forgetting stuff. But we have now adventured over to the other land. And now i got to start getting that place set up. And I'll probably get a little house uh, built over there in the meantime and kind of get a little safe spot so I don't have to be worried about that nightmare if I go into the nighttime. Uh, or the night dream or what, what, yeah nightmare that's what it's called um so we'll see but anyways guys i'm slider and oh god witchery is, yeah i i'm excited for witchery and i've said that like a hundred times oh my god i'm ready to get going on it so i'm actually probably going to put up the next episode uh within a day or two so uh until then guys i'm slider havoc and i'm out of here peace